The tactical and methodical application of the Quasar Cannon in Helldivers 2 can really turn the tide of the battle, especially when you're fighting against the automatons, which I believe was the main purpose of the Quasar Cannon's use to begin with. I say that because not only can it be very effective against exposed armor areas of the automatons as the majority of your turrets, the armor systems, whether it's the Hulk or the tank, mortar systems, etc. all have weak points to be exploited by a direct fire weapon system. In particular, the Quasar Cannon is very effective at knocking out dropships in one hit. If you hit the dropship in its engine, it will drop, well, the dropship. And the Quasar Cannon having a continuous fire functionality without needing to reload, albeit a long cooldown time between shots and a long charge up time, means this is the de facto weapon for engaging automatons, especially if you are solo as you can shut down the QRF capabilities or reinforcement capabilities of the automatons if used properly. So through this gameplay, you're gonna see a solo mission. It's a difficulty seven mission, suicide mission by myself where the main objective is to take on the airship capabilities of the automatons. And I use the Quasar Cannon quite a bit to maximize its capabilities. And you'll see that here, how if a group is taking on even a hell dive mission and you are collectively focusing on the dropship engines to mitigate the reinforcements, it can make missions pretty bearable. I don't think the Quasar Cannon needs a nerf. I think due to the cooldown and charge up, it's pretty balanced. So utilization of it properly makes it feel really good to use. And I think it's pretty balanced as is. So you're gonna see the continuous gameplay loop here. By the way, if you wanna support the channel, I do have a game store. You can head on to nexus.gg forward slash justinready 7 and proceed to purchase any of my tactical selection of games there. I also have a merchandise store if you would like to look into generic tactical merch or even my specific Helldivers 2 merch. My Love on Creek veteran shirt and my Liberty coffee mug has been pretty popular. So head on over there if you're interested. The link will also be displayed here and all these links will be displayed in the description below. But without further ado, thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoy the show. Someone dropping a tank out. Hear that? Hopefully that, uh, Drop ship drop and crush the tank. Bots be aim body, they be accurate. It's a big river. Murphy ain't that kind. Murphy can suck my ass right now, though. Fighting him back. I think we might be okay here. Uh, 
That looks like it's going to get deep. Maybe not. We might be okay. Probably waist high. As long as some fucking space croc or some shit doesn't come get me. Laser Arcana is going to get a lot of use today. to avoid your own minds. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that. You step on those mind bricks. Fabricator and go hit the ships. Takes care of the primary objectives. Need to get the fabricator now. And then clean up everything else. Thank you very much. Get the fuck out of here. storm that appears right before I get there. Alright, well then we're gonna chill out. There we go. Push fast, fast, fast. Our 
me. Oh, of course. Random run in with a rocket raider just shuts me completely down. I'm gonna take out a fabricator while I'm at it. <laughs> this up. the delivery. That's what you gotta do. Now where is this going? Oh, there. Put up in the last second. Two. Shit. Who the fuck is sniping me? Right. 
really fucking sick of getting hit. Bad boys to show up. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? So glad they're coming out with another movie. Not bad for a solo run. It still counts as a solo run because I called Extraction before Connor came in. <laughs>